Melissa Ortiz here coming at you with a weekend preview. I want to give some fem love to the U20 FIFA Women's World Cup winners, Japan. But I also want to congratulate Spain. They did a phenomenal job this entire tournament. That's what happens when your federation invests into your youth system. I'm just going to give like a pause right here and just wink to the team that I played for. <laughs> Rounded off to the Premier League this weekend, PL and USA that is. I'm clearing my schedule for two games. We got Liverpool versus Brighton and Albion because we all know that we can't pronounce that. Brighton's coming off a massive win from last weekend and they're facing off, of course, favorites of the league, I think, Liverpool, hashtag YNWA, YNWA. And clear your schedules, ladies and gents, on Monday afternoon, call in sick, <laughs> because Man U is facing off against Tottenham. Random news for the week, if you don't know, now you know. La Liga coming at you with a lot of problems. Está teniendo muchos problemas because players such as Messi, Sergio Ramos, Busquets, amongst many others, are against their recent agreement with Relevant Entertainment of hosting an in-season game here in the USA. So players are like, hey, we didn't approve of this. Hey, we have a busy schedule. This is against our rights, blah, blah, blah. And the League and Relevant Entertainment are like, hey, this is going to build our brand. This is for fandom. This is for money. So this is going to be a battle. Keep this story in mind how it develops.